faster than the fabric of space-time can keep up with it. And it'll just rip. And I'm terrified by this. In a celestial revelation that has sent shockwaves through the astronomical community, the James Webb Space Telescope has captured startling images indicating the impending explosion of Polaris, the North Star. Long revered as the night sky's focal point, Polaris is now on the verge of a catastrophic supernova. This event, poised to reshape our cosmic landscape, raises profound questions. Have we entered an era where the night sky's familiar guide, Polaris, transforms from being a cosmic reference point to a sign of celestial disorder? Finally, what implications will the Polaris supernova have on our existence on Earth? Join us as we explore how the Polaris supernova threatens to take the night sky all over the world. A startling blast occurred in the Russian city of Chelyabinsk on February 15, 2013. This event involved a large fireball, measuring approximately 17 to 20 meters, entering Earth's atmosphere at a velocity of around 11.8 miles per second. The energy released by this fireball was equivalent to 30 times the destructive power of the Hiroshima atomic bomb. The blast shattered windows, damaged buildings, and injured over 1,500 people, mainly due to flying glass. The shockwave generated by the explosion was unprecedented in that region. Fast forward to the present day, the James Webb Space Telescope has identified a potential threat approaching Earth, which poses a greater risk than the explosion in the Russian city of Chelyabinsk. This event has the potential for significant consequences. The Polaris supernova, once considered a baseless doomsday prophecy, has now been confirmed to be much closer than previously thought. A recent research paper from the Royal Astronomical Society in September last year raises concerns about our level of preparedness for the fate of this celestial luminary. Before we delve into why experts believe the Polaris supernova will dominate the night sky globally, let's take a closer look at Polaris, also known as the North Star. Positioned almost directly above Earth's North Pole, Polaris appears as a fixed point in the northern sky. It is part of a complex triple star system, with the primary component being a yellow supergiant, Polaris AA, orbiting a smaller companion star, Polaris AB, and both orbiting a third star called Polaris B. Due to its distance from Earth, approximately 323 light years away, the light we currently receive from Polaris originated over three centuries ago. This introduces the possibility that Polaris may have already exploded, and we have yet to observe the light from that event. Throughout history, Polaris has held cultural, navigational, and symbolic significance across various civilizations. It served as a crucial navigational aid for ancient mariners, played a role in Norse mythology, and guided escaped slaves along the Underground Railroad in the 19th century. In astronomy, Polaris has been essential as a reference point for observing celestial bodies and studying their motions. However, recent deviations from its expected pulsation pattern have raised concerns among astronomers. These irregularities may indicate an approaching end or significant changes in Polaris's behavior. Before exploring the potential impact of the Polaris supernova on the night sky, let's first understand whether similar data from the James Webb Space Telescope has been observed before, and if such a star explosion has occurred in modern history. The James Webb Space Telescope, being the largest and most advanced space telescope, can capture cosmic events that happened billions of years ago. Its infrared observation ability allows it to peer through cosmic dust clouds and witness the birth of stars and galaxies, making it a powerful tool for unraveling the secrets of deep space. Scientists were recently surprised by a revelation about Polaris. The James Webb Space Telescope discovered irregular pulsation patterns in the star, and alarming images transmitted to Earth suggested that Polaris was on the verge of a catastrophic explosion. In response to this discovery, scientists began searching for similar patterns in other stars. It turns out that Polaris is not alone in exhibiting such irregularities. Betelgeuse, a prominent star in the Orion constellation, shares similar unpredictable luminosity patterns. Both Polaris and Betelgeuse, known as Cepheid stars, 
go through various stages in their life cycles. These celestial entities pulsate regularly for a long time, but undergo peculiar changes in their brightness as they approach the end of their stellar journeys. NASA has been closely studying the anomalies exhibited by Betelgeuse and has expressed concerns about a potential explosion. In contrast, there haven't been similar levels of scrutiny and official announcements regarding Polaris. However, based on Polaris's irregular pulsations, scientists speculate that the star has entered the stages of helium depletion, a common occurrence in Cepheid stars nearing the end of their lives. As a Cepheid star exhausts its stable helium supply, it undergoes erratic pulsations that result in fluctuations in brightness. This depletion triggers a series of events leading to irregular light emissions, potentially reflecting the depletion process occurring within Polaris. While official announcements are pending, scientists are closely monitoring Polaris for any signs of further changes. The behavior of Polaris has sparked interest among astronomers, particularly its irregularities suggestive of entering the twilight phase. Despite ongoing analysis, conclusive evidence of Polaris nearing the end of its life cycle remains elusive. Should Polaris go supernova, it would be a breathtaking spectacle, potentially outshining the moon and becoming one of the brightest objects in the night sky for days, weeks, or even months. Such an event could alter our perception of familiar constellations like the Big Dipper or Ursa Minor as Polaris plays a crucial role in them. However, the explosion's impact on Earth would be minimal, given Polaris's distance and mass. Although not as visually striking as some supernovae, a Polaris explosion would captivate astronomers globally, contributing to our understanding of stellar evolution. Contrary to the typical fate of massive stars ending in a supernova explosion, Polaris is expected to have a different conclusion. Most supernovae result from a star's core collapse, leading to an explosion that disperses heavy elements. Polaris, however, is unlikely to follow this path. Instead, it may experience a catastrophic collapse triggered by the inability to withstand its gravitational forces. Supernovae are classified into Type 1 and Type 2, with Type 2 being more common in massive stars. Type 1 supernovae occur in binary star systems with a white dwarf. The explosion is triggered when the white dwarf accretes enough mass to reach a critical limit, leading to a nuclear fusion reaction. Type 1 supernovae provide a consistent brightness, serving as valuable tools for measuring cosmological distances and estimating the universe's age and expansion rate. After a supernova, the core collapse can result in a neutron star or a black hole. Neutron stars are incredibly dense, packing several solar masses into a compact space. In contrast, black holes possess infinitely dense cores, exerting a gravitational pull so powerful that not even light can escape. These remnants offer insight into the mysteries of the cosmos and contribute to our understanding of the universe's evolution. Polaris is not expected to meet its end in the dramatic fashion of a neutron star or a black hole due to its insufficient mass. While Polaris may seem sizable, being about five times more massive than our Sun, it falls short of the requirements for a cataclysmic supernova explosion. As Polaris approaches the end of its nuclear fuel supply, it will undergo a graceful transformation, shedding its outer layers and evolving into a white dwarf. This transformation won't result in a supernova spectacle but will end peacefully, leaving behind a small yet incredibly dense stellar remnant. A white dwarf has remarkable density, comparable in mass to our sun, but compressed to the size of our planet Earth. As Polaris exhausts its nuclear fuel and succumbs to the relentless pull of gravity, it will no longer be visible to us as we currently observe it from Earth. To anticipate the effects of Polaris's future transformation, we can draw parallels with documented supernova occurrences like the Crab Nebula SN1054 or SN1987A. By examining resulting phenomena such as the formation of nebula and the release of cosmic rays, we can gather valuable information. 
This analysis helps evaluate potential similarities in luminosity variations, elemental ejections, and the impact on the surrounding celestial environment, providing a foundation for understanding the aftermath of Polaris's transformation. Contrasting the anticipated outcomes of Polaris's burst with observed supernova events allows us to make predictions about its fate. Recent supernova, such as SN 2011 Fe and SN 2014 J, offer valuable data for comparison. Through the analysis of light curves, spectra, and remnants from these events, we can project similar characteristics onto Polaris's anticipated burst. This approach assists in predicting the potential evolutionary stages of the resulting celestial remnants. Scientists make definitive comparisons by examining disparities in mass composition and the speed of ejected materials between Polaris's burst and other observed events. Despite meticulous observations and extensive analysis, astronomers find themselves perplexed by the irregularities exhibited by Polaris. These irregularities defy conventional understanding and elude a complete explanation, making predicting the exact timing of Polaris's demise a formidable challenge. The mysterious behavior displayed by Polaris underscores the critical need for deeper investigations and dedicated research efforts. Polaris holds paramount importance in astronomical endeavors as a steadfast reference point for telescopic calibration and celestial navigation. The potential loss of Polaris due to a catastrophic event would significantly impact the accuracy of ground-based telescopes and celestial measurements. It would necessitate recalibration of our instruments and affect the precision of astronomical assessments. Such a loss would be irreplaceable. The puzzling nature of Polaris's irregular pulsations demands further scrutiny and investigation. Astronomers recognize the imperative need to delve into the underlying mechanisms responsible for the unprecedented behavior exhibited by this celestial entity. Unraveling the unique conditions driving Polaris's irregularities holds the key to advancing our comprehension of stellar evolution and behavior. However, the answer to this cosmic mystery remains elusive, and only time will reveal the truth. Well, spacers, what do we think? Share your thoughts on the potential Polaris supernova in the comments section. Thank you for staying tuned, and don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Thank you for spacing out with us and see you next video.